Okay, hello guys. So this is the Poco M3 Pro 5G. It's also known as the Redmi Note 10 5G, and it's also known as the Redmi Note 10 T with the code name is Chameleon. So in this video, I will show you how to do instant unlock boot order for respawn, and also root respawn using mages. Okay, so you don't have to wait for seven days. Okay, in this video. We're going to use the Mu 12.5.4 on Android 11. Okay, if you have different version, you can easily upgrade or downgrade it using a rename zip or other tools. Okay, so all the file and step I will provide in my blog. You can check the link or the link step and file in the description box. Okay, so stay tuned and check it out. Okay, hello guys, Assalamualaikum, with again with Ombop. So, in my hand now I have the Poco M3 Pro 5G, it's also known as the Redmi Note 10 5G with the codename as Chameleon. And in this video, I'll show you how to do instant unlock order in this one. Okay, as usual, first thing to do, let's check the setting system. You can see right here it's using the Mu 12.5. 0.4 on Android 11. Okay, <clears throat> and it has 6 GB of RAM and 128 GB of internal storage. So, if you want to do the instant unlock bootloader, make sure you are in the firmware version. And if you don't, you can easily upgrade it, okay, or downgrade using a zip rename file or a class using a dongle or other tools okay let's make sure it's this version okay first thing to do let's enable the default option hit the mute version five times and then go back find the additional settings and go to the default options <clears> hey <throat> okay. oh, i'm unlock and Let's hit the unlock status and you can see right here the device is still locked. Okay. Next step, let's turn off the phone and let's switch to the desktop. So in here I already have the tools, okay the MDK GSM tool tank. Usually we use the version 1.3.8 now, we use the version 1.3.9. Make sure you have Install the driver, okay, the USB and MediaTek driver, okay, all the file and driver and the step I'll provide in my blog. Check the link in the description box, okay. And next, you need to disable the antivirus, okay, because the antivirus will will detect the tools as virus. Okay, let's go to here, find the in this defender uh the threat protection and disable the real time protection and okay it's already disabled and if you don't uh feel safe don't use these tools okay this is safe i already use it no problem with uh, my computer and and it's up to you okay let's open it and okay when it's open it will ask for user login you just insert whatever id you want to and the password is user okay same password for all hit login and you will see display support oppo realme blah 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 stuff okay all all the need all we need to do is go to the universal okay hit the universal button and hit the unlock bootloader okay it will initiate and the next step we need to press the form up form down on the pawn and then plug the usb cable okay let's try it and here we go now it's detect the port and start initiating 
is wait until it's until the process is done <clears throat> okay usually it takes uh it's about one minute if i'm not mistaken okay all process is done nice must this one let's open the cmd unplug usb cable and let's now uh, put it into the facebook mode okay as usual facebook mode can be accessed by pressing the floor down power button at the same time wait several minutes okay you're good to go now let's plug the usb cable and now check the bootloader status okay just type fastboot uh okay let's check this real number first and then type fastboot get far uh, sorry fastboot get far all okay and you will see a bunch of stuff okay just scroll down and for the chameleon okay and the bootloader now the status of the bootloader now is yes it means we have successfully unlocked the bootloader <clears throat> okay and now let's put it again to the android let's see if there's any error message because we are using the unofficial unlock bootloader okay you can see right here there is zero message and we're going to try to fix it okay and now we are in the facebook mode again okay let's try to fix the dm problem first thing you need you need to have is the vb meta i uh, will also provide the file okay and let's open the powershell that this woman facebook disable blah 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 click and drag the file and when it's done we need to go to the stock recovery let's put reboot recovery and because we want to format the data okay now let's unplug the usb cable wait until it's booted okay and scroll down using the form up palm down select web data select web data and confirm okay hit back menu reboot to the system and let's wait okay now it seems that we don't have any m 40 message problem again and we still have the unlock tutorial status okay before so in here you can see i already have the uh, patch boot image using my zelda okay let's flash the boot image pass boot flash boot space and then just click and drag the file uh, sorry let's plug the usb cable Okay, now let's reboot again. Press boot space reboot. By the way, you can also flash the custom recovery if you want to, but it has a bug. It doesn't support the touch screen, so you have to use the mouse using the OTG. Okay, now let's find the file manager. Okay allow it and i already copied the magis apk right here we're using the delta one okay install unknown source wait for five uh ten seconds okay it is confirmation and hit okay go back install it and when it finishes you can open the apps usually for the first time it will ask to complete the task so it will automatically reboot upon okay require require additional setups it's okay 
and it will reboot and now we are in the home screen again okay let's open the mages and here we go now we have a working mages right here and i also have installed some apps root beer advanced root checker okay let's open the root beer first it will show us the souvenir has been detected read it nice okay now the advanced root checker also shown us it has been read okay you can always disable the root detection by enable the magic set right here this one and this one okay and okay, let's open this one <coughs> It's using the MediaTek Dimensity, blah blah blah. And you can check the spec right here. Okay, that's all, guys. I hope it helps you. If you find it helpful, you can always give it a thumb or subscribe to my channel. Okay, and if you want to buy me coffee, you can always check the description link for the PayPal or Saveria. Okay, so see you in the next video. Wassalamualaikum.